Today we're playing Babysitter Story because we're a bunch of babies. <laughs> we're going to the babysitter's place. Me and James, Patrick, Eugene. You look a little familiar, Eugene. Where I seen you before. I want to be a parent. I'm an adult. I'm the boss. Your parents went on vacation for a few days. Don't you talk to me like that. I'm a grown man. I make my own bed. I feed myself sometimes. So I'll be taking care of you guys. First, let's set up a scavenger hunt. I don't like your tone, Riley. Find 10 teddy bears that are hidden throughout the house. That's a lot of teddy bears. You got a lot of teddy bears. I do respect the staircase color choice. Ooh, ooh, found one. Ooh, don't you dare touch that. It's mine. Good job, everyone. You found one. Yay. This house looks... So fun. Why is your name Tuck? It's Tom. What do you guys want to eat? Uh, pizza burger. I want pizza and a burger. Put them together. Get the scientists on. They probably figured this out by now. We have to find a way to combine these two things. You can't make me choose, damn it. I couldn't pick. It looks like pizza one. Okay, you know what? I like pizza. Give me the pizza. I'm a pizza connoisseur. No, 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 no. What is this? What is this? Some Chuck E. Cheese pizza? You got that Pizza Hut pizza? That joint tastes like cardboard. Don't touch the ground. Let's see who can win. Oh, uh, what are we doing? You're not putting children's lives in danger, are you, Riley? Go? Go? What? What is this? <gasps> Guys, if you touch the ground, Riley will shoot you with her gun. So don't stand there. Yeah, she wasn't kidding. She really trying to kill these kids. Luckily, I'm a responsible adult, and I brought a baseball bet. As soon as this sick, twisted game is over, me and Riley are going to have a little conversation outside. Someone has to die. Come on. Or else the game's not really fun. If there's no risk, why should I be scared? Oh, God. Oh, God, please. I actually got nervous there for a second. I was actually scared. Can we play again? You want to do that again? You should be thankful we made it out of there with our lives. Maybe tomorrow. It's getting late. But if you sleep now, we can play again tomorrow. Good night. Good night, Riley. Our nice babysitter, Riley, who would never do anything to hurt us. You guys hear that? No, I really can't hear anything over this repetitive song that can't be muted. Who's that, Riley? Riley just fell in the shower, like, really hard. She hit her head. Oh, looks like you guys are coming with me monster guy i presume this is the guy we're supposed to be afraid of guys run why are you waving at me <laughs> he's trying to give me a behind hug don't let him behind hug you it's a trick it's actually not really a behind hug this is probably the most intense boss fight that i've ever experienced look at him oh oh he's killing me it's not fun anymore what's all that noise i told you kids to go to bed uh we were attacked by like a demon or something thank goodness you're here we saw a monster seriously that's your excuse really you tried to kill us it really did though oh please go back to bed what do you know riley i'm an adult i'm gonna i am an adult right or my kid. You can't be bossed around. That's what I'm talking about. And yet she's trying to boss me around saying, I didn't see what I saw. Come downstairs. Time for breakfast. And then we're going to play another one of those games that where if you lose, you die. You're one twisted lady. You know that, Riley? You want twisted broad. What do you guys want to eat? Pizza burger. I don't want any of this. The smart man would choose pancakes. Waffles are pretty good, but they're not that good. Okay, I ate the pancake. Head to the playroom. All right. What do I got to play a baby game for? I'm an adult. I'm a grown man. I'm just short. She won't let me leave. I'm just a short guy. I have a wife. I have kids. Whoa, look. I found a key on the ground. Oh, basement key for sure. Let's go in there. This key must open the basement. What are you, what are you, genius? Thanks, Einstein. We found the key to the one door that's locked. I don't trust Tom. He's probably working with Riley and the demon. They're probably all friends. They hang out and they play Halo 3 on the weekends. She'll never find us down here. I don't know. Uh, I feel like she would probably find us down here, guys. What? The door's open now. This place is creepy. What do you mean? There's just boxes. We got to open the door before we can say if it's creepy or not. I don't think we're supposed to be down here. No dip. It was locked. Let's open the door. What do you guys say? Uh, I guess, okay. I guess we got in the safe door somehow. I like how we couldn't get past a simple locked door, but when it comes to a sealed vault, we just waltz right in. I knew it. Riley is working with the demon or she is the demon and she wears the demon's skin and terrorizes children in her free time. That's the only explanation I'm a genius i'm a detective do not question me guys i think we're in the monster's secret lair tom you are five steps behind <laughs> so this is where she keeps all the dead kids huh riley 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 i am giving you a terrible review on google loot the area for weapons we have a bat what else do we need i mean if one of these skeletons had you know a sword or maybe a machine gun then that would be worth taking but we have a perfectly good baseball bat call me david ortiz i'm knocking him out of the park call me big pop i'm gonna make you regret the day you mess with me and my friends who are children but i'm a grown man 
but I am the same size as them. We've already been over this. Skeletons, prepare to die. Prepare to feel pain. You're dead once, I'm gonna kill you again. I'm gonna make you double dead. I'll fight by your side, Tom. No, I don't care about Tom. Look at him, he's all the way back there. He's a coward. He doesn't even have his bat ready. This is so epic. This is so freaking epic. This is so freaking epic. That that was like the climax of the whole story. <laughs> I knew you guys could do it. Thanks for literally nothing, Tom. You did nothing. You stood there. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, it worked. We did it. We did it, guys. <laughs> this is not the right music for, like, escaping a deadly cave. This is not it. You know, I don't, I don't like being a Debbie Downer, but, like, this might know that. What the heck? What is this? Oh, Riley, we know your secrets, Riley. We know about your crazy cave with the freaking demon in it, so. I recorded it on my phone because I'm a man, not a kid. Kids, is that you? I mean, I'm not a kid, but yeah. Riley, we went through the giant door in the basement. We found a scary lair. Wait, how did you get down here? Riley, it's her house, dude. What do you think? You guys saw everything, huh? This is not a shock. I, I saw this coming literally the second we started playing the game. That was my secret layer, and you guys were supposed to see that, so now I have to kill you. Well, now I need to get rid of you. Yeah, I knew. I'm sorry, kids. Why are you sorry? Oh, she's gassing us. Okay, yeah, I'd be sorry about that, too. This is kind of a problematic part of the story. You guys need to get through the air vent. Okay, Tom. I'm the only one here, by the way. We're not leaving without you, Tom. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Come on. Come on. We're leaving him. You can't tell me he's not in on it. Look at his shorts. They got holes in them. Am I supposed to feel sad for Tom? And don't let Riley get away with this. I'm rolling my eyes. I'm rolling my eyes in real life right now. Okay, bye, Tom. How come we didn't pass out, but Tom did? Kind of weird. Continuity-wise, that doesn't really make a lot of sense. But I don't know what to do now that he's not here with us. Come on, guys. Think, guys. How do we get out of here? Stop Riley. Guys. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's just me. Let's click this button. Self-destruct initiated. Oh, uh, whoops. All right, uh, I'm this way probably, right? Riley, you killed Tom Riley and countless other children. Started with so many kids here, and now they're all gone. It's kind of like Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, except it's Riley and a demon or something. I'm sorry, kids. I can't let you walk out of here. Do you have schizophrenia? I am the only one here. You'll pay for what you did to Tom. Yeah, and all those other kids. Who cares about Tom? Fine, you made me do this. Do what? What is she, what is she doing? What is she doing? Oh, boss battle. Ready. Uh, okay, I'll just buy that. This is gonna take so long. What? If only I had my friends with me. I'm gonna get revenge for all the fallen children that have died to Riley's hand. And she's just gonna stand there and let me do it for some reason. Not sure why. Not sure what's going on. Please die. Please die. Please. Yes. Ah. All right, guys. You defeated me. What? You're not dead? I thought we literally killed you. I spent so long beating you to death i'm sorry that i did this to all of you and tom no you're not you're dead i killed you why are you apologizing if you're dead what is her fate leave riley save riley who the heck voted i'm the only one here who is still in the game it's just me did riley get to vote all right i guess we can help you no fools did you really think that i would let you walk out of here alive i'm taking you down with me what is what what is what? That was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. That was the weirdest ending. I need to stop playing games like this. Really, at the end of it, I feel like I was made worse because of playing them. And I don't think that's healthy.